Hi guys, this is part two of our Howie saga. Howie is the black more goldfish right there in my fish tank. She has thrived for the past few years in my tank. I'm so excited because the black more goldfish has always been my favorite. As a kid, I would get them and of course, you know, um, aquarium, the industry wasn't as good back then and the things that we had and plus I was only like 10 I think when I set up my first fish tank so I had some trouble keeping the black moors and now I'm so excited 40 years later um, that I can have my own black moor goldfish and she's doing well um, and I also have salt water upstairs but so I kind of have eased into the fish keeping but I'm really excited about Howie she's a female and we have male goldfish who are um, inclined to want to breed with Howie so we put in a spotting mop and we took Howie out of the colander at my last uh, video that I put on Facebook here where we had separated her because she was getting a little worn out this is just a mop head that we have um, made sure that it had no antibacterial qualities or anything special in it and we boiled that and then put it down into our tank and this will ensure that whenever she does develop eggs and get um, big enough, I'm not sure if she's round enough yet, but if she does develop eggs and get big enough, then the boys can push her towards the spotting mop there and her eggs will stick to the mop and then we should be able to take the eggs out, put them in another tank on the side of this tank that we'll have set up for baby fry. I have had raised live bear fry before, which are fish that give birth to live babies. I have never raised um, fry from eggs and goldfish do lay eggs, so this would be an interesting thing to see. And we're excited. My daughter, Roma, will be doing most of the work. Um, I have it all in my brain, but my body is not able to do it at the moment. So she's going to be doing it, and I will be helping her and the sidelines as much as I can to be successful. And hopefully we will get some baby goldfish. And um, it will be exciting colors, I think, because Howie's black. And this guy here, if, you know, Leonard happens to, or Sheldon happens to help, sometimes they do a mass spawning, so there'll be some orange and white. And this guy, Raj, is just gorgeous. He's, um, I believe he's called a Rukin, um fancy goldfish, and he just has some gorgeous colors. So if we do get fry, um, you know, the sky's the limit. And of course, how he has the telescoping eyes, um, these guys do not. This guy has a win, which is that thing on top of his head that little orange thing bubble on top of his head and um, so some of them could get different different qualities and that would be really neat to see what my daughter could do as far as um, raising some fish up of course we're, we're stocked max here at this tank I only like to have four fancies in a 55 gallon any more than that is just um, they don't have enough room for goldfish they really need a lot of room and a lot a lot of water changes so this is what's happening in our neck of the woods in our fish tank and if we do get babies um, eggs and we decide to go that route to raise them up we will let you know bye guys say bye howie